Scattered Melodies has always had a passion for music videos. In the true DIY spirit, they continue to use their smaller budgets as an inspiration to become more creative when striving to capture on screen what they imagine in their minds. Lyrically, their song Neighborhood was already an ode to those who grew up in the 1990s, so when it came time to film the music video for it, they took on the challenge on recreating the world of 1993 got the idea overall of the video from a cool gif I saw online of some kids with Nerf blasters. Um, and so the idea of the hand cannons kind of took off what there's a lot of information online about cosplay and how to make foam props. So just kind of took some foam mats, um, other small foam boards, used a heat gun and some paints and just kind of molded these blasters out of some cardboard tubes I found. It was a lot of fun really taking this idea that um, just kind of stemmed from something small and grew and grew and grew the more and more I listened to the song. So it was really nice to get to lay that out through the storyboards and then through filming and after editing as well. Just a lot of process to the whole thing, which I don't know, it's really cool. <laughs> it's just super silly to see it like see it happening, so that's, that's dope. Mm. Yeah, dude, and that all stayed in focus. Oh, that yeah. was real good. Yeah, this music video was a lot of fun to work on in particular, I think, because we were doing a period piece that was taking place in 1993, so literally everything on screen had to look like it was in the 90s. You know, I was hitting up thrift stores, getting all the VHS tapes, cassette tapes, all the band posters, the right board games, just everything in the bedroom needed to feel like it was 1993. Making sure all, everyone's outfits looked like they were in the 90s, and you know, it was just a really fun challenge. And working with the kids was great too. You know, it's always fun asking the parents, hey, can we, uh, have your kids in our music video. Oh, and by the way, can we electrocute them too? Can I get that? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, no. <laughs> After calling a wrap on the bulk of the scenes, it was now time to make the pet tortoise Phoebe come to life. A transformation in the form of a vicious video game villain. The things we do for art. Better melodies, you better be fucking big. <laughs> Found a cool store online that had a reptilian, which worked perfectly to try to incorporate Chaz the monster with Phoebe the tortoise. Oh yeah, dude. Look at that mouth too big. I'm a straw. <laughs> Can't please you, Chaz. Can you see someone you're <laughs> like you're like yeah. looking and you see him like you're <laughs> This blast was kind of cool too because what it did was I ended up rotating. They were blasts, but then they would like kind of go up. So as they went, I rotated the animation. Oh, so it aims at him. So it aims at him, so like it ends up at him. Because before it was like going up above his head. From the music video's inception, the boys knew that post-production would be the most extensive part of the process, leading them into new editing territory from their prior videos. Well, for this video, we dove into effects way more than we ever have. On, on Black Hole, we started doing that, and especially in After Effects, but this one was a completely different beast. We got this crazy effects pack with blasters and all that, and it was very general, so we had to figure out how to like make that work for our video. And yeah, so After Effects, motion sensing, all that kind of stuff, we had never done before. We knew we could, but we, we had never done it before, so it was pretty wild. It was a, it was a big thing to take on. 
So when Chaz was over at my house filming his scene for the video, um, he heard my six month old baby doing the crazy squeals that he does and suggested that we should use that for the uh, sound effect for the villain, which was a light bulb moment for me because duh. So um, I recorded a bunch of sounds of my little guy doing his thing. So here's an example of a regular baby squeal. Okay. So I, you know, I had a bunch of different sounds, so I would take them all into the editor and uh, stack them on top of each other, put different effects on different ones. So here is a baby turn villain scream. Through dedication of the arts and pure love for the process of making music videos, Scattered Melodies is proud to have another visual representation of their music to release into the world. The journey is never an easy one, but if you experience it with the people you love, it makes it that much more enjoyable. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, I forgot you had a mustache, dude. <laughs> <laughs> you should look at yourself right now. You see the new Scatter Melodies video? <laughs> you look like some backwards redneck who tried to commit a robbery. Straight up, yeah. <laughs> <laughs>